Slow talk under center. And he will fake it and keep it running to the right. Turning up field, spinning off a tackle. Touchdown, Ducks. The quack attack is back. Trey Slotok into the end zone from 12 yards out. And it's a seven-play drive for the Ducks. And they convert for the touchdown on third down and eight. Averaging nearly 60 points per game. But they've got a fourth down and eight at the 35. Under six to go in the first quarter. Ducks lead 6-0 in the state semi. Larner claps his hands. Gets the shotgun snap. Dancing around in the pocket. Wants to throw. He's being rushed. He'll flush out to the left. Now he's going to run it as he is hit at the 30 and smashed backwards. It's going to be a stop for the Ducks on fourth down. Trey Slodok came up and hammered Lerner near the sideline. Two yards shy of the lead stick. There's your stop, Zealand West fans. First down, Ducks at their own 30. Slodok the quarterback, who will he give it to? He'll go to Vanderswag, and I think he got stopped. He got upended and dropped, and that is massive for DeWitt. Lucas Brandell made the tackle. He's flexing his muscles at the 40-yard line. It is indeed a half yard short, and DeWitt will take over with 152 left in the first quarter. Call it a gain of one. Looks like it'll be a spread look again. So interesting. They do the single wing and they do the spread. Old school meets modern. Larner steps back. Throwing deep. It's incomplete. He tried to zing it in there into a tight window to his brother Abram. Instead, it bounces into the end zone untouched. And the Ducks get their second consecutive turnover on downs. You lose your discipline as a defense. Slodok will throw on the play fake. Complete out the... Keaton Hendricks on the near side running, cutting back to the 50, to the 40. Hendricks in the clear, headed for the goal line. Touchdown, Ducks! Just a little pass out into the flat. Hendricks made two or three Panthers miss, and he takes it the distance. 78-yard touchdown strike from Slodok to Hendricks. The seniors connect, and the Ducks lead 12-0 here at Forest Hills Eastern. Tight formation, all 11 players in close. Larner, QB sneak, did he make it? Yes, touchdown to Witt. Larner for one, and a nine-play drive ends in a touchdown for DeWitt. Make it 12-6. Slodok faking, he's going to pass it. Wide open downfield, Will Skaggs makes the catch at the 25. He's gone. Touchdown, Zeeland West. The play fake worked to perfection. 50-yard touchdown pass. Slodok is three for three, and he's got two scoring tosses, and the Ducks lead it 18-7. 3.31 to go in the second quarter. You just as a defense have to gear up for the the power on third and short, and the Ducks took advantage of that. And, of course, third down's more like second down for them because they know they're going for it on fourth. I'm sure that can free you up mentally as well. Two-point conversion attempt. Wing T look. Fake to Leslie. Slowlock throws out to the left flat, and it's a good two-point conversion to Isaac Vanderswag. He's the most frequent target on those two-point passes. It's his eighth two-point catch of the season and the Ducks get back on track in that category. They're up 20 to seven. There's one blemish for DeWitt over the years. They're just six and eight in the semifinal round. They're here a lot. Here's fourth down, Larner stepping, throwing, incomplete. He threw it behind Abram Larner in the end zone. He had him open, but he misfired. Larner was running to the right. Excuse me, Abram Larner was running to the right. Elliot Larner, the quarterback, Gunned it back against the grain, and it dropped to the turf. The Ducks get another defensive stop, another turnover on downs. That's three times they've gotten a stop on fourth down. Fourth down and two, just a one-yard gain for Elliott Larner. The Ducks have stopped the Panthers all three times. They've gone forward on fourth down so far. Here's another attempt. Handoff going to the right to Moore, and I don't think he made it. He stopped short. First down, Ducks. They strung him out, did the Ducks defense. And Bauman and Slodok involved on the hit. 
Trey Slodok continues his two-way mastery for Zeeland West. Handoff goes to Leslie. Lost the football, and DeWitt is on it. Oh, my, what a time for a turnover. Picking up the ball, Cooper Chambers, the linebacker at the 30, or pardon me, the 44-yard line. First turnover of the day, at least a non-turnover on downs for the Ducks. First turnover in that fashion for either side. The fumble on Leslie's carry on third and two, and DeWitt is still alive. The Panthers come out in a spread shotgun look again. More in the backfield with Larner. Larner gets the snap, rolls immediately to his right, looking to throw it downfield into the end zone. It is... Caught for the touchdown. It's his twin brother Abram in the right back corner and the Panthers are alive. It's 20 to 13. They convert the turnover into a touchdown. 24 yard pass from Elliott to Abram Larner. And it's an onside kick and it's not gonna go far enough. It's not gonna make it past the 50. It's just gonna roll, roll, roll out of bounds. Oh my, just like Zeeland West on the first kickoff of the game for them. The onside kick doesn't go far enough for DeWitt. It was that very same look too. Just, you gotta get it 10 yards. Fourth downs, these possession downs, key to the success of the Ducks over the years. Leslie Vanderswag in the backfield and it'll be Slodok instead throwing the play action. Again, it's complete to Vanderswag. Catches at the 20. He's tracked down inside the 15 to the 12. The play action passing continues to bear fruit. Trey Slodok is four for four. The wing T formation. The quarterback, Trey Slodhawk, under his center, Jace Henry, hands off. Vanderswag punches his way in for the touchdown. Isaac Vanderswag, the senior, one yard touchdown run. That caps a seven play drive for the Ducks. They went 41 yards and they lead it by 13 points, two point try pending. That Ducks front. Challenged here. Larner drops back to pass. Throws back corner. It'll be a touchdown to the left side. Jaden Bender again. Another reception for him. 11 yards this time. Just too many receivers in the end zone for the Ducks to adequately cover. And DeWitt is back within a score. Both sides of the stadium. Amplifying the volume from the 47 of Zeeland West. Third and four, Slothawk going to roll out to his right. He's got the first down just past the lead marker, and he delivers a huge blow on one of the defenders, knocked him back. Oh, boy, and that defender is down and not moving. At least I think that was Slothawk who hit him. I don't think that was a, the result of a block. But his vision for power football has come to fruition here. Inside handoff, Keaton Hendricks up the middle, going to the far side, touchdown! Zeeland West, 19 yard score. Hendricks' longest carry of the afternoon. 32 to 20. It's been a spectacular season for this DeWitt offense, but limited to just 20 points so far today. Larner dropping back. Throws a moon ball down the left sideline, incomplete! It falls in the end zone, untouched. He was looking for Bender, wasn't really open. Turnover on downs, the Ducks take over, and that might have just done it. DeWitt's got just the one timeout remaining. Will the Ducks be going a couple hours east next week. We're about to find out. Leslie carrying the football with two hands. He's right to the lead stick over the 50 to the 48. And if it's a first down, this thing's all but over. And it is. The referee says move those chains. 129 left. The clock stopped for the movement of the chain gang, and DeWitt takes its final timeout to stop the clock. But folks, that's not gonna matter if the Ducks can just hold on to the football. 
they can kneel it out with 129 remaining. On third down, John Shiloto motioning, saying, hey, let's just get this thing knelt down one more time and, and call it a day. 29 seconds left. The Ducks to the line of scrimmage. Trey Slodog takes the knee. And for the fifth time, the Zeeland West Ducks will dance their way to Detroit. They get the upset win this afternoon at Forest Hills Eastern. Your final score, Ducks 32, DeWitt Panthers 20. The Ducks improve to 12-1. and one. And we'll see you at Ford Field next Saturday at 12.30 for the Division Three State Final. Handshakes at midfield as the final seconds melt away here at Hawks Stadium. Yes, the Ducks have done it for the first time in nine years. They will play for a championship down in Detroit. DeWitt suffers its first loss of the season. The Panthers came in averaging nearly 60 points per game. Zeeland West gives them just 20 in a monumental victory this afternoon. It is a final in the state semifinal, and the Ducks, many of whom lost in this round last year to Forest Hill Central. Well, they make up for that in a big way. They beat Forest Hill Central last week, the defending state champs. They take down the number one seed, DeWitt, today. And we'll take a break on Michigan Sports Radio, bring it back for the postgame show. Great to be with you again today. Thank you for joining us on MSR, and there'll be more to come next week. How about that?